and some licensed teachers from the 46 public colleges of education have alleged bias on the part of government in its recent postings. The teachers who say they completed in 2016 and 2017 say they were left out because there was no financial clearance for them. The visibly worried licensed teachers besieged the premises of TV3 after what they claimed to be several weeks of attempt to seek redress from the Education Ministry. They alleged they were left out purely out of convenience since government had always had plans for the 2018 graduates. The 2016-2017 graduates alleged though they had their posting delayed to coincide with the 2018 graduate, they have been left out. They had to take part in the newly introduced teacher licensure examinations and undergo national service, which is an addition and one of three requirements to qualify to be posted. The teachers allege they had all the requirements which qualified them to be posted. Last two weeks, they released 2018 badge for posting. When we, the 2017 badge, we go through the names, we were not where to be found. We questioned ourselves several times. We don't know what to do. We waited to see if they would release another posting. The week ends. We didn't hear any information. We came to the Ministry of Education to understand all for them to explain to us the reason why we, the 2018 badge, the criteria or the documents that they are using to post the 2018 badge. We also have those three things and the online registration that they asked us to do. We did all those things. They took 10, 10 cities from us. They didn't post us just to explain the reason why they refused us of their posting. The unposted teachers also say, though they have made several attempts to get in the Ministry of Education to address their challenge, but nothing seems to be done. We went there Monday, they didn't mind us. Tuesday, they did not mind us. It was four o'clock in the evening when the Minister of Education, which is Honorable Napo, he was coming out and we all surrounded his car. So at least he should send some people to come and listen to our grievances and then help us. He asked our leaders to go to his office and then book appointments, which our leaders listened to him, went and then booked the appointments. He met our leaders and he promised us, Napo, together with the uh, Director General, they met our leaders and they promised us that we should go back. They will address our issue. We waited Monday. They didn't even mind us. They didn't even call our, our uh, leaders to explain anything to them as if we are not Ghanaians or we are not what, uh, human beings. They say a meeting with the Deputy Minister of Education and officers at the ministry revealed the financial clearance did not cover them. Oh, everything of us is 2018 except the index number from college. from college. We all graduated from the 46 colleges of education in Ghana. So we are coming to see for a little clarification why we are not posted. And they say finance minister didn't give them a financial credit to post all of us. They only give them few financial credit to post. So if we want posting, then we have to write for a credit from finance minister before they can post us. They want government to come clear on reasons why they were left out of the postings.